What's good YouTube? Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be showing how to grow a motivational page on Instagram. It's 2021 and you're probably sick and tired of motivational pages. That's because they're being very generic and ideally I'm guessing you want to build one that actually helps people and actually has loyal followers. So so let's get to the first step know who your ideal follower is are you appealing to a younger demographic 15 to 22 are you going to help more uh, professionals in their career in their 30s trying to help mothers with kids and trying to motivate them uh the more specific you can be the more the easier it's going to be because you're not you're not being vague you're trying to help a specific audience because you're going to be helping a specific audience and there's nothing wrong with that there's nothing wrong with cutting out the rest of the people to help a group of people because the more the more specific you are the more valuable your content is going to be to them if that makes sense because everyone else is just being generic but then there's you who's like helping this specific group of people's problems when no one else is okay so know who your ideal follower is step two i want you to be optimizing every part of your account before we get started so that means your bio story highlights your logo the post that you're sharing and uh, optimize it. I've got a vi my last video explains how to optimize it. And because you want to make a good first impression to the people that stumble upon your page. And these are the, those were the factors that would help. Cause imagine I have no idea who you are, but if I see the logos on point, if I read the bio and I see it, it's going to help me if I follow you and then stuff like that, then of course I'm going to follow. So you put, use that to your power step three you got to identify at least one to two things that make you stand out from the rest now whether you find motivational pages uh, corny or like helpful you got there's so many of them all right there's a lot of people competing with each other so you gotta find like one to two things that make you stand out so that kind of it could be like brand colors it could be the people you're trying to help again your target audience it could be the way you talk, your like voice. Do you like talk more professionally or do you use a bit more slang? All right. And make sure that comes through in your posts. Okay. So just find a few things to make you stand out. And that goes a long way. Number four, you got to avoid. Number four might be the most important step. Avoid generic content. Avoid generic motivation. You got to be more specific. If you're going to share something motivate, like I you think is motivating, just be more make sure it's specific at least make sure what you want to happen is when your ideal follower your target audience is reading it they can be like oh i never thought of it that way let me apply it to my life it has to be like applicable maybe actionable but just make sure it's specific because people are getting tired i'm sure you're getting tired as well of seeing just you know really generic sayings like there's too many there's too many to name i'm not going to name them now or it could be breaking a common belief so for example there's a common belief that you need to that you need to abandon sleep and you just have to work all the way you just have to you just have to work so hard that you you need to put sleep to the side and a that's biologically not true okay there's a myriad of benefits with sleep b you can come in and just be like Come in and like you need sleep and here's why and just be like don't listen to the people saying to abandon sleep you know break the limiting belief break the common beliefs that are going around and then that's going to get more attention okay what i find does really well too is uh action steps or bullet points or step by steps so you can be like step one do this step two do that step three keep it short and then people, I guarantee you will get a lot more saves and a lot more shares. And the next step to grow a motivational page on Instagram is to engage with your followers. Okay, because they're coming in. If they're liking, commenting, saving it, sharing it. If they're sending you DMs, being like, thank you, your post has changed. This post changed my life or your page has changed my life. Then you got to pay that forward, pay, repay them some way at least reply to them nothing's going to beat the fact that you're being personal nothing's going to beat the fact that you're like that you're having one-to-one -one conversations with these people and just being intimate i guarantee 95 percent of motivational pages aren't going to be doing that 
treat them with good customer service, I like to say. And the final point is just to stay consistent. And not just with posting, but the one to two things that I mentioned earlier that will make you stand out. Like color scheme, for example, stay consistent with that. Um, if your theme is like, if your theme is the Twitter theme, which I've been seeing a lot, people tweet and then they edit it on Canva and then they post it as a motivational post. Uh, stick to that for a while because you need to you need to get time to build that uh, report and just get people familiar with your style. When it comes to posting as well, just pick a schedule that works for you and stick to that schedule. Okay, so if you do all these steps, finding something that makes you stand out, knowing your target audience, engaging with people, sharing specific information, then you will stand out from 95% of the other motivational pages. And they're gonna be looking at you like, how did you do that, okay? Not only that, but as you give it more time, you keep engaging, keep showing your followers love, you're gonna build a tribe that's gonna back you. You're gonna build a tribe that's just gonna support you, support every product that you sell, every service that you release, every post that you post, you know what I mean loyal followers and there's nothing better than that okay so if you enjoyed this po if you enjoy this video i want you to like it share it with a friend and subscribe for more and i'll see you in the next one cheers